Hey there everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today we're going to talk about a topic that's crucial for maintaining good health, staying hydrated. If you're new here, consider subscribing so you won't miss out on our latest tips for a healthier you. Now in today's video, we're delving into a topic that's fundamental to your well-being, proper hydration. So let's dive in and explore how staying hydrated can positively impact your health. We all know that there are numerous ways to take care of our health, but one of the fundamental aspects is ensuring we meet our daily water intake. However, remember, it's essential not to go overboard. And let's not forget, moderation is key, even when consuming yogurt. So in this video, I'll discuss the effects on our bodies if we were to excessively consume water and also shed light on the best times to drink water. Now, you've probably heard the recommendation of drinking eight glasses of water a day, equivalent to around two liters. It's a common guideline and most of us are familiar with it. The primary goal of this water consumption is to prevent dehydration and ensure our body functions optimally. But did you know that there are specific timings that can enhance the effectiveness of this practice? Let's jump right into it. Tip number one, hydration while sick. First, let's address the importance of hydration when you're not feeling your best. When you're down with a fever, your body's metabolism is on overdrive, leading to increased sweating and higher water requirements. That's why, during such times, it's recommended to drink more water, especially when you're sweating profusely. This helps maintain your body's fluid balance and aids in the recovery process. Tip number two, hydration upon waking up. Moving on to our next point, drinking water as soon as you wake up. This simple habit can kickstart your metabolism and prepare your body for the day ahead. When you sleep, your body goes without fluids for several hours, which is why hydrating yourself in the morning helps replenish what's lost during the night. It also helps neutralize stomach acid, providing a comfortable start to your day. On tip number three, hydration before meals. Now let's talk about staying hydrated before meals. Consuming a glass of water around 30 minutes before your meal can aid in controlling your appetite. You'll find that you won't overeat as your body will feel fuller faster. So if you're aiming to manage your food intake or perhaps working on weight loss, this simple practice can make a significant difference. Tip number four, hydration when fatigued. Feeling tired, drained, or experiencing a lack of concentration? Well, it might be due to dehydration. Our bodies are predominantly made up of water and even a slight dip in hydration levels can lead to fatigue, headaches, and difficulty focusing. Whenever you notice these symptoms, make it a point to grab a glass of water and give your body the hydration it deserves. Tip number five, hydration during and after exercise. Last but not least, let's discuss the role of hydration during and after exercise. When you're active, your body sweats to regulate its temperature. Replenishing lost fluids during and after your workout is essential to avoid dehydration. Remember, sipping water during your exercise routine can help maintain your performance levels, and drinking water afterward aids in recovery and rehydration. Before we wrap up, I'd like to emphasize the importance of exploring our playlist, where you'll discover a wealth of essential health insights and effective tactics for safeguarding against various illnesses. This collection is brimming with beneficial knowledge that will empower you to stay well-informed and aligned with your journey towards a more health-conscious way of living. Once you've finished watching this video, don't forget to navigate to our playlist for a seamless continuation of your learning experience. And there you have it, a breakdown of optimal water consumption throughout the day to keep your body in top shape. Remember, water is your body's best friend, and it's crucial to listen to its signals and stay hydrated. So, whether you're recovering from an illness, starting your day, preparing for a meal, combating fatigue, or engaging in physical activity, make sure you're giving your body the hydration it needs. If you found this information helpful, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and leave your thoughts in the comments below. And as always, stay healthy, stay hydrated, and until next time, take care.